Hey guys, well, we all saw this one coming eventually, and uh, someone has finally delivered. So I'm going to show you guys how to Brutal Wolf 3D. So links of course are in the description, and we are using GZ Doom just like we did with the Brutal Doom video. If you haven't checked out the Brutal Doom video, take a look at the links in the description. Anyway, so what we need first and foremost is, of course, GZ Doom 1.9 Pre-828. Now I have updated the links in the Brutal Doom video and uh, also the Steam guides that I've done as uh, the link that uh, was previously in there was not available anymore. Um, for those of you that are a bit worried about the links, because uh, I have had a few comments of that. Now these links originally came from this view topic here, the version 4.5 update which was done by Zio McCall who uh, posted the links here for the downloads. Now they are Mediafire. I know some people are a bit worried about Mediafire links, but I have downloaded it, played around with it, got it working, and this is why I'm showing you the video. So, first up of course, we need to download Brutal Wolfenstein version 4.52. So as you can see there, that's a safe download and I've already pre-downloaded them all here, as well as the GV Dome. So you also need the Brutal Wolf music pack. It does make it a lot nicer, as you can see there. Download perfectly safe, no worries at all. And by saving as, you can see that that's all perfectly fine and legit as well. Okay, so. No, I'm not interested in sports bet. So, of course what we then need is not that folder. What we then need is of course to unpackage the zips. So what you do is you start off with GZ Doom, everything inside this folder, unpackage it out into another folder for GZ Doom. Afterwards, of course you will also need the PK3 file for Brutal Wolf 3D. Just copy that into the Brutal Wolf 3D folder. Same thing again with the music block. So just drag it out and throw it into your Brutal Wolf 3D. Now you can if you really want to, if you have previously set up your Brutal Doom, is just copy your any file or my any file of course which is also available in the uh, links below in the description of uh, the Brutal Doom and we just need to edit a couple of lines in the folder. So those of you that are quite familiar with the config here, all of the settings are all set in here and what we really want to do is just set it for doom.autoload. So you want to add patch and path of the version there of the PK3 file, so as you can see, it's the same name, bw-v4.5.pk3, and the bw-musicpack.wad, which is right there, bw-musicpack.wad. After entering all of those in, just want to launch up GZ Doom and run. Now, this mod actually works with Doom 2 doesn't work with any other version because of the way that the textures load, you actually do want to run it with Doom 2. If you don't have Doom 2, well, please purchase it from the Steam Store. I don't uh, recommend you grabbing the WAD files and uh, getting them illegally because of course they are still not open source. Whereas uh, Wolfenstein 3D of course became open source many a year ago now. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and happy Wolf 3Ding!